Project Imhotep is an intensive summer internship program held on the campus of Morehouse College for college upperclassmen and recent undergraduates, designed to increase the knowledge and skills of underrepresented minority students in the field of public health. One of my first management positions in government back in 1968 was to develop young people uh, to come to the U.S. Public Health Service uh, in a traineeship. And what became clear after a while is that people needed more training than they would have normally gotten at, particularly at HBCU, but generally. And so what we wanted to do was to create an entity that would develop students who would be the best candidates in the schools of public health. Uh, and so that's what Project Imhotep was about. The program includes a variety of seminars, workshops, and concentrated educational training and public health courses, such as public health and health disparities, epidemiology, biostatistics, and scientific writing, taught by accomplished interdisciplinary scholars and teachers. It is the highlight of my um, teaching year every single year, um, an opportunity to teach you know, students who look like me, um, who are fabulous, who are wonderful, who are bright, interested in pursuing a field in public health um, is just so rewarding. With support from the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention Office of Minority Health and Health Equity, the goal of Project Imhotep is to increase the quality and quantity of well-trained professionals from underrepresented and underserved populations into the public health workforce. Interns are paired with mentors from the CDC or other federal, state, and local government agencies, academic institutions, or community-based organizations as they complete a public health research project. People can come right into our doors and receive help, and I really wanted students to be able to capture that. It's wonderful when you study public health, but it's a whole different thing when you see it firsthand and you feel it and you realize the difference of sort of data and then the, that actual on-hand experience. Um, so our typical day here would include us conducting research for um, our mentor, Dr. Z, and she's examining drug users' attitudes towards methadone. So we'll go usually to um, one of our outreach locations in the Bluff and conduct interviews there with injection drug users. This will be a project that will will also help other students become uh, tomorrow's workers in the public health arena. Interns are also required to complete 16 hours of community service. When we provide access to basic needs such as food, uh, toiletries, diapers, um, regular household supplies, we are allowing the underserved communities to have a better quality of life. The intern's summer-long experience culminates with an oral poster presentation to their peers, mentors, and public health professionals, including a written manuscript suitable for publication in a scientific journal. Since Project Imhotep's inception in 1982, over 800 students from approximately 300 different colleges and universities have participated. Three quarters have gone on to pursue or are currently pursuing graduate degrees and more than half currently hold a public health position in federal, state, or local level government, academia, and non-governmental organizations. My colleagues now are that did Project in Motel with me, they're now working all over the country and sometimes over the world, and that's a resource that I'm able to use. And so for these students, that's even more people that they have in their um, toolbox. I am so appreciative of the work that you all have done but even more appreciative of the work that you will do. The thing that I like to ask every year is, how are you gonna change the world? You might want to have a nice house and a nice car and make sure you get that check, but the really important thing is, how are you gonna change the world? For more information, please visit our website, morehouse.edu slash phsi slash imhotep.